Hey guys, this is going to be part two of my journey, which is my health and fitness, my clean eating and, and fitness part. Um, once I got done with my 40 day juice fast, I kind of jumped back and forth between juicing and eating what I felt was healthy or what I thought was healthy. Um, and I would do this over and over and over again. And um, because I became so good at it, I guess, I became a juice coach. So I helped people through their juice, uh, juice fasts. <clears throat> After <clears throat> excuse me, doing this for a while, I could tell that people were kind of using it as a yo-yo diet, which is what I was doing, and I knew that I needed to focus on my health and fitness. So ironically, in a juicing group, I came across a health and fitness coach who focuses more on paleo slash um, clean eating, and then um, she also incorporates daily fitness into her um, routine. I saw she was a very busy mom of two, you know, and... She had energy all the time. She was so positive. Like, everything that she exuded, I loved about her. You know, she was just so full of confidence. And I, I wanted that so bad. And what was amazing was that she wasn't even at her goal weight. But, man, she owned it, you know. And I wanted that. So I talked to her a little bit and, you know, found out a little bit more about her. And um, after talking for a little while, she told me that she thought I would be a great coach. And... I felt like there's no way I'm not near, you know, my goal as far as health and fitness are concerned, my goal weight, um, and fitness. Are you kidding me? I haven't worked out since I was forced to, you know, in middle school. <laughs> kind of a lie. And, it, you know, I, I couldn't see that in myself, but she most certainly did see the leader in me. And I just told her, whatever, let me join your group and we'll talk about me being a coach later. So I joined her group and it was amazing. I learned how to eat clean. I was in a group with a bunch of other people who were also starting off at the same level as I was, plus some that had been, you know, doing things for a little bit longer. And um, we would work out every day. We would take pictures as our, our proof, you know, and post these little sweaty pictures in there. We would take pictures of our food and post it. And uh, that's really where I learned how to eat the right foods and a balanced meal. And I learned the difference between the sugars that come in a donut and the sugars that you get in an orange, you know, not the same sugars. Um, so... That really honestly changed my life, and with the help of my coach and with the help of me becoming a coach and having my talent members help me, I was able to break my goal of getting down below 130 pounds, 35 pounds, so um, that felt amazing, and um, my only problem was that once I got there, I never set the next step, so once I got there, I kind of floundered for a little bit. And that's going to lead me to my next video, which is going to be part three, which is my current and ongoing journey to fulfillment and happiness.